Hello and welcome to the Reddit recap for December 2022, the last one of course for 2022, where I'm going to look at the things that people have submitted to my subreddit, the most upvoted ones of course by my 103,000 members. Hopefully we'll see some good stuff to cap off the year. Yay, world record. Submitted by Dark Viper AU on 2019. Verified by Dark Viper AU on 2019. It is a system on speedrun.com where mods are able to verify their own runs. Not all runs do this, mind you, but ours does. And obviously, even a mod, if you submit a significant time, everyone's gonna watch your run anyway. Things will, of course, be picked up if something is amiss. Is it rigged? Absolutely. Pictures of Matt, but he is slightly shorter. Did I have that chair in that picture? I mean, it's not a bad Photoshop job. <laughs> you haven't shortened my legs at all. It's just the way, it's just the torso. At least now, like, the heights go down. Terrible, but thank you. Australian government doesn't want you to see these pictures. Is being short illegal over there? No, but short people are encouraged to stay as much as they can indoors as to not get lost in the Australian bush or to get mistaken for joys. I mean, he's not wrong. Saddest video ever. I can't believe he didn't cry during Titanic. Do men even have feelings? Just again, I did cry during Titanic the first time I saw it. Just so you know. But of course, the comparison, the last ever outro, and the dude looking haunted as fuck. For Pacifist, I actually thought to myself, I should just put the outro here again. So people be like, oh my god, it's the outro! And like, people like, hit like and stuff. But I forgot to do it, so I didn't do it. Yeah, end of an era. It's just one less thing. Like, you can go back to that video whenever you want and look at every outro I've ever made. And just so you know, most people didn't watch most of the video. It shows you how much people love the outro. They weren't even willing to watch a whole video about the outro. How the ending ended. What the fuck is Matto doing on r slash teenagers? I hate Dark Viper AU. I hate his voice. Arg. I usually like the Australian accent, but it makes me want to rip my ears off. I was just like, yeah, not everyone's gonna like my accent. It's just totally cool, whatever, it's just fine. Why was I there? Like if you, what is it, you slash and my name on Reddit, I will be there at some point in the next couple of days. So few people do that and I get no other notifications for any other purpose that I will see what you've posted. I put Maso in the Titanic movie. You know, I always kind of liked you. <laughs> my piss smells like McDonald's. Your ship is a wonder, Mr. Andrews, truly. Thank you, Rose. It's hot garbage. <laughs> and where exactly do you live, Mr. Dawson? Fuck you. <laughs> I changed my mind. They said you might- Shut the fuck up! What? <laughs> Sharks. The dolphins of the sea. I, what? Went to the bathroom so fast, I almost tore my dick off. Why put these lines in there? I say other things! <laughs> so I'm trying to kill someone, you inconsiderate prick. What's that? <laughs> Can anyone hear me? Help, help, I have been fucked by a bush. <laughs> I don't get to live? That was the dumbest thing I've ever seen, but I'm very happy to have seen it. It's ironic how Matt was laughing as people are falling when I remember him saying it was one of the only movie scenes that made him cry. Yes, that was the scene where I cried because everyone was dying and panicking and I was just like, oh, this is so sad. Laugh my ass off when I got this staff member in MGSV. Base development unit, Dark Viper. Oh, looking at the rest of these, it looks like just random two words. So you just have to randomize like the word dark and the word viper. This should be changed to the based development unit because if I was on a development unit, it would be based. I'm sorry. Petting a cute doggo for Masso. Oh, so cute. It would kill so many people if allowed. There's one damn cute evil thing that is clearly not a doggo, but thank you. There aren't cougars in real life. Clearly they are though, in the same way there are cougars in missions, unfortunately. Rockstar made a Dark Paper AU reference in the game. <laughs> well, I clearly can't read the rest of this, but it says millions to one when talking about the Cargo Bob Jet Sam. In the same way that it's millions to one that I'll remember the name Cargo Bob, because of all vehicles, it is the one that I've forgotten the most. So I appreciate Rockstar making that clearly obvious reference to me. This is old news. Rockstar is such a big fan of Matto that they added cougars in the game. Is this the proper response? Rolls Royce new NFT collection is live. 800 NFTs for the first 800 people. You picked the wrong house, fool! That is the correct response. Are there seriously still 
bots posting about NFT collections to just random subreddits? What is wrong with people? I don't mean just the bots, I mean people who still think NFTs are a thing. Still waiting. Matto saying he would do a snow run. Me. I hope you're hungry. For nothing. I'll do it one day, guys. So it's been, what, like, five years that you've been waiting? Even before you, like, knew me, you were technically, to some degree, waiting for the snow run. And, uh, you know, five more years? It's not gonna be a big deal, right? We've got time. GTA 6 is definitely at least, you know, ten years away. So, it's almost Christmas. He better do that soon. But I didn't. Maybe next year. Or maybe we'll do it based on my winter. When does winter start in Australia? June the 1st. Is it odd that I still don't know that after having lived through 31 winters? No. Saw the tweet and had to comment. Bad YouTube content in a video from The Quartering, because it's every video. What a disingenuous, dense motherfucker. I bet he knows nothing about nothing and can't even tie his shoes. For real, honestly, on Twitter, this meme has followed The Quartering for years. I'd be interested what he thinks about it. Surely it must annoy him to some degree, right? Also, bad news, the video of me calling The Quartering a disingenuous, dense motherfucker was demonetized recently because I said fuck, like, at the beginning twice. I guess I do get left comments sometimes with that, like, oh, this is where that meme's from. So maybe you guys know the meme independent of that video. Yeah, because there's clips and posts on Reddit and stuff. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Hmm. Tag the most creative creator of 2022. Griefer Jesus tags me. He's always tagging me with these rare gun men. He can tag me on Twitter too. I get tagged in these a lot. And you'd think it would get annoying to be tagged in these things over and over again. But it's it feels good every single time. Where a person sees this, and the first thing comes to their mind is, hey, Dark Vap AU. That's cool. It's one thing to know that there are people out there who hold me as their favorite creator. It's another thing entirely to, like, be told that. Thank you guys for watching my stuff. Mom, get the camera! Mom, get the camera. I'm in a Dark Vap AU video. I think I saw you post this on Twitter, I think. Because this is when I was scrolling through all of the Tide World Records for the Mass Percent World Record. There's like a hundred plus or something now. Of course, I was the first, so that's what matters. I remember a while back, I got a month ban from chatting because I said poop. I hunted down the video just to see my name pop up for a brief moment. Oh, there it is. Immortalized now in two videos. Is it wrong for me to immortalize something this stupid? Because it may inspire more people to do it? Yes, it is dumb. Uh, no one do this or you will also be banned for a month. And you will not make it into any videos. But they weren't banned for a month. I was confused why they would be banned for a month. What a liar. Matto stopped doing Keo Perico. My parents in their 30s. Let's have a baby. Me in my 30s. Does Keo Perico highest for the 99,999th time. I have not done Keo Perico that many times. You gotta understand, even though GC Online feels old for a lot of people, I haven't played it all that much, relatively speaking. So most of it still feels pretty new to me. When I think on GC Online now, I'm like, I can't wanna play that game. There's nothing I have to do in it though, so I won't. I need to start like making 5M like a part of my routine and just finding a server that enables me to do normal GT Online stuff. I did do some 5M's, 5M stuff recently in a custom server, which might eventually become a video. How Maso will probably die. Kai of Pius, an ancient Athenian philosopher, died from laughing at one of his own jokes. That's a pretty good thing to be immortalized for, right? Or at the very least, if you're gonna die, you'd kind of hope that you'd die in a way that people like thousands of years later would still be talking about it, you know? I could totally see me even looking like this in old age, being made of stone, that's what I'm saying. How <laughs> the speedrunner ended. There aren't cougars in Arizona. The shadow of a cougar appears twice a year on the side of the Superstition Mountains. Wait, they're actually called the Superstition Mountains? What is he eating there? A butterfly? Of course, this is just an example of how, you know, we read patterns into stuff that aren't necessarily there. The odds of, like, literally no shadow of any mountain in the history of the world ever being perceivable as being somewhat similar to a cougar at some point is astronomical. Just to be a buzzkill, you know, there aren't actually shadow cougars in real life. There aren't shadow cougars in real life. We must revolt. Shadow makes its own outro. Put this little woofle on every post. Be sure to upvote and comment. I wish you all the best. That is pretty awesome, but uh, I don't think it's gonna happen. Can we make an exception? Where the activists throw tomato sauce at Dark Viper EU picture, <laughs> turning him orange. <laughs> That'll show me. I'll be sure to change my orange ways. Hey, see, I don't look orange now in the picture. See, activism works. 
They protesting rule number six. <laughs> no orange face posts. NPC hipster matter. <laughs> Doing a mo. <laughs> <laughs> ah, so lame. So, so very lame. This is when I was in Melbourne with TGG and we were playing in some arcade. I never won that goddamn wheel. I'm not that sure, chat. It's angled down, okay? When you're too tired, you just have to stop. Me trying to catch my breath, my PE teacher. You non running motherfucker! It is a great insult, honestly. Wish it was applicable to more situations. Got bored during lecture, so opened that back page of my notebook and saw this. A jiffy is an actual unit of time for one one hundredth of a second. This dude going to like the expensive private schools where they give you all the secret knowledge. Source internet on the bottom right. Does it really say that? It really does say source the internet. Holy shit. Okay, maybe not that good of a good of a school. <laughs> maybe this book was made recently and the dude saw the clip. Thick, 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 thick. Did you know Jiffy? 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 Did you know a Jiffy? Did you know a Jiffy is an actual measure? Did you know a Jiffy is an actual measurement? Did you know that a Jiffy is an actual measurement of time? And then made it into a book. So thank you for watching everyone. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you everyone who posted and upvoted things on my subreddit to make these episodes possible. They of course are catch up episodes. So if your thing didn't get seen, there's a possibility that it will get seen in that video where my mod goes through to find the best stuff that didn't get enough love. So yeah, see you in the next episode. I wish you all the best.